Okay, hopefully it that's the only thing that doesn't seem to work ever. It turns itself off. <laughs> In the setup time, it always turns itself off. All right, go ahead and say something, Mecca. Life in pain said, howdy, howdy. Okay, that means it's working. I don't know if I can get it any higher. I was hoping you'd be like. <laughs> That's exactly what I needed, Mecca. All right. So now we've got a speaker bar, so I don't need to have earbuds. All right, thank, thank you for doing that shout out here. All right. And in case Nail is hiding in the background, there is a new redeem. I know you've always wanted me to do high point redeems to try and get rid of your points, or you keep taunting me about it. So I put in a new redeem specifically for today. All right. So, well, that was fast. Oh. Hey, JP. Um, not, not trying to scare you guys, but I'll be right back. I gotta go change. Alright, so who's ready to start clipping all of this stuff? Because it's going to be fun. Check out! Ah. Uh. That's alright. So yeah, I, I'm going to go ahead and take a uh, lesson from the book of Boyd. And, well, I'm just going to wear this the entire stream. So you guys enjoy all you want. <laughs> All right, but let's. It is a Triceratops onesie, complete with tail. Let me see if I can pull it up. Tail. It's supposed to be a. But yeah, so I thought it'd be fun to join the onesie crew. <laughs> oh, geez. That would explain a lot. One second here, guys. Let's see if I can figure out how to... That should work, I think. Hopefully. I mean... 
I don't have much of what you would call shame. Um, okay, that's the cornice mold. Where is... Oh yeah, I had to throw that piece out. So let's cut a tiny little sliver of this boy off. Oh no, because there's only like, I think two of us or three of us that have done this. I, I'm just shameless or shameless. Who knows? Okay, we're going to cut a small piece of this off so I have a good template because I accidentally destroyed the last template. Boop -doo. Also, Mecca, I found my little uh, saw sharpening guide, finally. Okay, there. Yeah, I think that's it. I don't know if Lettuce did one as well. But I mean, I just don't have shame, so. Like I said, there are, there are stories of me from college that make people blush, like running obstacle courses in a kilt and the kilt fell off. All right, so now that we're set up, Well, I hope so. I hope so. I'm actually going to be wearing it at a costume party tonight as well. Let's get, uh... Get it flipped over so you guys can at least admire my... Ooh, very interesting. It falls over a little bit. But hey, that should have come to a notice to me because this is a 36 inch long... These are 36 inch long shooting boards. So we're going to just continue on. We're going to start making the moldings for, ooh. Let's start with this one. That one had, that one's like absolutely, if I must, I will. Um, because it had a knot going straight through the middle of it. And here I go, oh, I don't have my uh, apron, so half the stuff I need is way over that side because I usually hang my apron right here, but it would be right in front of the... We gotta fix the top cam, don't we? Okay. That way you get absolutely no woodworking. Just a giant fluff of Triceratops. I was gonna, I, I just want a dinosaur, tell you the truth. That's awesome. <laughs> so what I'm doing right now is just tracing the end pattern because this is our template piece and I'm going to do that. Hey dear, are you on the road or, or are you about to be on the road? Okay, I need to do it this way. Okay, um, um, um. I just need to pay extra attention. Gotcha. Well, they they redeemed the uh, the costume pretty much immediately, so at least you get to see me in this woodworking. Because they're savages, and they they have to see me woodworking in this. Just joking. And you know I love you guys. 
I wouldn't put up a redeem if I wasn't going to do it. Let's put it that way. <laughs> I wouldn't put a redeem up if I wasn't going to do it. Also, Mecca. Check it out. I got the double-sided one again. I'm going to have to sharpen the tips, but I've got it. Okay, let's start here. Well, let's start with the easy ones. Let's start with the back rabbit. And put a dent in my board. Luckily, on the side, that's going to be completely obliterated, so it doesn't matter. Yeah, and that's why I went out and found another one. I really do like it. It's the, uh, for those need, needing to know, it's a Stanley 71 marking gauge. I really do like that thing. Just my old one kind of imploded on itself. This one has a good block on it. This one's probably about to implode on itself, but I can always make a new uh, block. I'll be surprised if we get through a full stick, or well, if we get through two sticks, I should say. Um, that was the one I had early on last year, dear, and, and it literally, the block just exploded apart from too much pressure because of how old it was and how bad condition it was in. I think I still have the brass bits from it, but it, it just kind of... I'm um, not trying to steal your thunder, but I am still thinking about doing marking gauges as giveaways. Just <laughs> got to get back from having my shop, uh, shop disturbed. And uh, sometime this week, I'm going to be uh, shellacking your uh, marking gauge here, Mecca. Okay, there's the depth lines I need for the back rabbit. Now we move on to the front design. Do -do 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 -do. You know, it'd be great if I pulled out like 10 marking gauges <laughs> that were all set to the different lengths, because you really do need like 10. But. Quite, quite honestly, probably would. They probably would. We have different tastes. Not a bad thing, not a good thing, just we have different tastes. You can definitely tell this costume is polyester. <laughs> Definitely tell. But yeah, I thought people would at least have a nice little hoot out of me going, ah, eh, I'll, I'll do, I'll do a costume. I'll do a onesie. I imagine I'm probably going to take some picture of me in this and turn it into an emote as well. To steal from Boyd. Okay. 
Wonder how long it'll be before Bad Dad and Boyd and all them find out that I'm doing this. I mean, I haven't been really quiet about it, but I mean, like, if they're gonna show up and heckle. All right. All right. I'm not a rhino, though. I, I guess triceratops are endangered, if you call it that way. I know it looks like a rhino, though, because the, the, the top just doesn't perform like I thought it would. Maybe I should have went with the, tr the Tyrannosaurus, but my mind has been made up. I like it. Triceratops is, ah, thank you. <laughs> Just trying to make sure I understood the word correctly because, well. Eh, it's all right. Ah. <sighs> Rhinoceros text to speech. <laughs> Tell you the truth, I don't know why I'm drawing this line because I'm not going to use it. <laughs> but I got halfway through it before I remembered what I did last time. So, got to commit. Um, let me look at what you just typed so I can, um, so the old one, and you can, I can kind of somewhat show you what, what happened to the old one. Um, I mean, all right, because it's easier for me to do it this way. So this is just like my old one where it has, you know, two different sticks and two different pull, uh, pulley things. Basically what had happened, and I see what they did on this one, which is smarter. Um, where the grain goes this way and that way, uh, you can kind of see it here. Stress cracks were forming and then I over tightened it once and the block just blew up. Then I glued it back together and then it cracked in another place. So I was like, screw it, we're done. Um, this one, on the other hand, the grain is running this way and it has these nice little slider bars gluing it together in the opposite direction. So this one might actually last a good bit. Mm. All right, and then I need one more line. Right about there. Yep, yep, that do. Do 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 do
do, 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 do. And we'll remember, hopefully on the future sticks, not to draw that extra line that I didn't need. Because I'm not going to use it at all. Let me see if I can fix this real quick. There we go. All right. Now, it is back rabbit time. Not going to lie, this is like my new favorite plane. Back rabbit. Give me two seconds there, whoever redeemed that. Also, good question. Can you guys hear the text-to-speech? Mm. Still hotter than hell. Whew. It's, it's actually tea today. Just English breakfast with a little bit of... A little bit of honey in it. <laughs> I'm glad that like on Halloween I had very low labor intensive stuff like making sticking molding. Just barely. Just barely. Yeah, because it is, it is very light. I thought it would be louder than it. Yeah, so it's not detracting. Right now I have it at max volume and it is very light. I really love the shavings this thing makes. Just these super tight spirals. Yeah, they're like super springs. I think that would get me down to the fence, see? Springies. I. Uh, yeah, it is the exact same design I did on Wednesday. Uh, Wednesday was figuring out all of the uh, the steps needed on the new sticking board. We are actually making the sticks for the frame at this point. So th this piece is going to be in the frame. We're actually making the molding for the frame at the moment. No, no longer practice, no longer getting used to things, we're making it. I like this nice chocolate streak here in the... Uh, in the poplar. And yeah, the frame is going to be poplar because it's cheap, it's easy, it's there. Unfortunately, I didn't do it. No proof. Uh, unfortunately, the back rabbit takes the longest. And those who've been missing the interruptions of the sump pump, you can rejoice. We fi I figured out a way to run the stream and have the sump pump plugged in at the same time. There it is. Um, I 
So we just basically just used a different outlet that is not in the garage and just ran an extension cord there. Okay, let me ex examine how this is going down. That would be hilarious. We can try. We can try. Um, my original idea was to make a miniature coffin plane, a miniature functional like coffin plane as a ornament. Wooden tinsel. <laughs> Biodegradable what? Oh, okay. <laughs> Biodegradable what now? Okay. I'm trying to even out the uh, the rabbit because I'm a little <laughs> toe heavy still. <laughs> But that's why you draw those reference lines. Hmm, that's scary. So we'll fix that now. I think the difference with me, I, I don't know. I didn't actually get to see Boyd's stream when he did a onesie, but I'm just wearing it and going about my business. Like, okay, I'm on a onesie, big deal. Gonna continue woodworking here. I know at least that's the difference with me and Bad Dad. Because he made a big old stink about wearing it. I was like, it's just a onesie, man. Ah, there we go. Back rabbit achieved. Smoother than a baby's bottom.
<laughs> I forgot to dis I forgot to disable that. All right, well, one second here. Do do do. Hey, Timber, how you doing? Let's see, where is it at? Say hello. Hey. I'll be nice though. <laughs> thank, thank you for te bug testing, I guess, dear. There. We are now a Pyrosaurus Rex. Pyrosaurus Rex. There you go. Okay, we got the back rabbit. And it fits. Good, good, good. Oh, nice. You got to see what you, you got to meet TJ. That's awesome. At some point in time, I may actually be uh, meeting uh, what's it, uh, James Wright, but that'll be in the future. Ah, okay. I am playing a balancing act, and that really will screw with me, but I did it. Give me two seconds. I got to pay nice and close attention to what I'm doing right now. Because starting the rabbit takes a little finesse. With this plane. Because you got to do that one nice straight line. Well, that looks like we're going against the grain. Which is fine because... Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm sorry, guys. They at least started doing like non video, uh, non video ads as well at some point in time, which is a little less obtrusive because it just pops up with like. Here's some Clearasil or whatever they want to try and hawk at you. I did at least figure out how, what was wrong with my subscriber thing and got that fixed. That's exactly my story, and I'm sticking to it, Freefall. He's been eaten.
Yeah, there we go. How you doing, Deep Sea? <laughs> I'm just glad to be making curlies. <laughs> I'm glad you guys are finding this fun. <laughs> it reminds me of when I went full pirate on the stream. You never know, that might happen again. Just, it takes a little bit of time to get into that outfit because of how much stuff's on my pirate garb. I mean, I'm not gonna, not gonna lie. I mean, if you guys wanna... I'm not against it. <laughs> You never know, I might put a kilt on at some point, too. I mean, I do own a kilt. Um, I figured out what I was doing wrong setting the iron, so it no longer steps down. That, that would be the biggest tweak I've done. Or are you talking about the side rabbit plane that I, I posted on Instagram? Which I could also bring out and show off. Oh, whoa. Wes just now figured out there's a problem. <laughs> there's a snake in my boot. Um, then that would be this guy, I believe, then. You're saying there were no Scottish dinosaurs. No Scottish dinosaurs at all. <laughs> no Kiltosaurus Rex? I mean, the only thing I could think of as a uh, modification to the planes is all of them have my name stamp on them now. <laughs> That's how this works. Wow, I found out the secret to get you guys talking. I'm gonna have to start wearing costumes more often. Taking notes on what? I'm confused. Uh, I... Gotcha, gotcha on how to get people talking. I mean, I was in there, I was in your stream, what was it, a couple days ago, or was it yesterday? I don't remember what day it was anymore.
you haven't seen it. Um, I actually don't own it anymore either. I had a little like Menards table saw. Wait, what's her fake? <laughs> Days. Okay, do my cleanup there. One more. You have a flat bottom, so I can just leave you there. Hey, I mean, those things are finger removers. There's nothing, nothing to joke about. They also look. Now we're just doing, a, because we're working on the back end, we're going to go ahead and just do everything I can on the back end. So this little step rabbit down and this side of the bead, we're getting done now. I think we got one more pass and we're done. Uh, one more pass. Yeah, no. Whoo, can definitely tell this is polyester. <laughs> Sorry if I rattled your ears, guys. Okay. All right, now, now we're not using this portion because now we need to put the back rabbit here. Uh-oh. going on here hmm that's interesting I had no problem here of course I had no problem because it was okay I'm not going any further down though I don't think let me double check something here with the most inaccurate. Oh, no, we'll use this. Yeah, power tools, no joke, man. No joke at all. All right, we're just going to do a little bit of fine tuning here because I already screwed this up. Whoa, one or two more passes. Oh no, we'll have to fix the rabbit plane. That's not hard.
That works. Okay, and then we do this one. This one's gonna sound nasty because I'm cutting through glue as well. I mean, axes are a part of woodworking. Axes are a part of woodworking. Whether or not someone tells you it, I don't use them very often, but they are a part of woodworking. Okay, now, still, oh man. Oh, I see what the problem is now. This is going to be dangerous. Let's get dangerous, guys. I see what the problem is. It's I have no way to do this well. I said the men with no shame. Where there's a will, there's me. One more pass here, like that. Wow, that is, that's a little much there. Okay, now it sits even, good, even enough. We're gonna be using that, you can always take a little more off. At this point, even enough. Me? Are you, are you talking to me, Loki? Yeah, yeah. That's, uh, that's the name of the game there. We're all stupid. Just how stupid are we? Oh, oh cool. I was doing just fine, freaking out over nothing, I guess. For people who do D&D, &D, all you have to do is figure out, is it bludgeoning damage or is it slash damage and pierce damage? But everything can be a weapon, slash, everything can do damage. Ah, oh, Jesus. Yeah, I am going over here. One second here. Make sure I get that cut correctly. <sighs> Yeah. 
And I'm using D&D &D as like a, a encompassing term because like I haven't played D&D &D since 3.5. Well, actually I played four once. Box cutters are strangely dangerous. God. Let's try and fix this again. Luckily, like I said, we're going down a long ways with this one, so it's one of those. We're just going to make it very evident right now. There. There we go. Going at full speed. Full speed ahead. Whew. Hey, Yankee, how you doing? Uh, whew. Yeah, this is okay, guys. I I need to like I need to open like a breathing hole. Um. Um. Right now, we're making molding to make a picture frame. Uh, the molding specifically we're making looks like this with a little back rabbit for the all right yeah but I'll live through my shame That's all right. I'm always here to answer. Okay, well, you gotta explain to me why I'm like a frog crawling out of a stork. I am so con. Oh shoot! I forgot to do this. Let me let me do this. I know, but I mean, like, how does it apply to me? I'm. I'm that's the part where I'm like. Sorry. But then again, I mean, I'm not going to take offense to it. I'm just kind of confused. Uh, like, is it because that I refuse to take the thing off and I'm just going to suffer through it? Or... Oh, gotcha. That makes more sense. That makes more sense. Now I'm slowly coming out of the dinosaur, whether I, whether the dino wants it or not. Got it. Ah, I keep.
Dürüm. <laughs> yeah, I may be regretting this decision here in a few minutes. Oh, we really only got, well, yeah, we're just going <laughs> to, I hate to do this to you guys, but I, I really do need to get out of this thing. <laughs> not, not because it, <laughs> I, I really need to get out of this because I am sweating from every orifice. Jump, 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 jump. Give me a second, guys. Basically sweating out of every corner of me. Oh. <laughs> now the fun part is when I wear that to a party tonight. And I'm going to be sweating from every angle. <laughs> All right, people. <laughs> Jesus. We just gotta keep digging down here, guys. Unfortunately, it takes forever. Give me a second here. Where is. Just wanna see where we're at with it. So I still want it. Yeah, that is definitely what's going to happen because what I was wearing, like the. Specifically just this side. Don't know why. Like the, this part sits fine. Sorry, I'm finagling with this, but I'm getting tired of holding it at a weird angle. Also, it's a rabbiting plane here, so it should. I don't know why I'm pulling out a rabbiting block plane, guys. I'm an idiot. I have a rabbiting plane right here. What 
hell is going on? Where is it hitting? It's fine here. And it's not fine here. How about this? Sorry, I'm getting obsessed with this because it, it is straight up annoying. That it's doing that. Excellent chance, how you doing? Um, okay, so it did move it down that way. Okay. Let's see. Did that do it? Whatever. This is better. So I guess we're doing good. Now I can at least hold it up and down. Time to get back on track. Time to screw that down just a hair. So I don't end up butchering my rabbit point. Hey, stand in TW. You just missed. The onesie action. send you an address then if you if you really want to send that to me I'll, I'll send you an address to send it over to so don't worry about that stand in TW I'll, I'll 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 get you an address I'm This one, we're getting there guys, I swear. We're, we're at least moving on to something new, or in, to a new rabbit. All right, give me two seconds. Um, we are making a sticker board we're, we're making a frame and then putting, you know, quarter inch plywood into it, 
But we're making a sticker board. This is the profile I decided to go with for the sticker board. Um, that That's just the sticker from it being a one by two of, of poplar. Um, but we're gonna make a frame out of this kind of profile, put a quarter inch piece of plywood in the back, and then all the maker stickers that I have are gonna be going into it. And I'll find some way to hang it up here or display it somewhere in the stream. Yeah, the dinosaurs had too much polyester. They overheated. That's why they went extinct. And you can trust me because I have degrees. Do I have degrees in paleontology? No, but you can trust me. That's basically what I'm doing right now is like every time I get something from a maker or whatever, I, I end up getting stickers. So I at least want to get their stickers displayed. Because, um, I mean, honestly, like I've got a little skull carving from TJ um, and, a, and his stickers. I've got like Obsessed Pirates stickers. I've got some from Boy. Do I have some from Boyd? I don't know. I'll have to check. When I got, when, when they... <laughs> if you think so. I was just being contrary, which is a special skill I have. that emote <laughs> nice all right hydration time I feel like the more I get used to these the faster I'll get at making profiles but And who knows, maybe I'll end up using these to make like defined profiles. So like if I ever want to make this again, I might just make myself a... I'm pretty sure most Scottish people are contrary. That makes sense. That makes sense. Not agreeing. But I mean, I won't disagree at this point. So we'll just keep plowing down. Keep plowing down, guys. I should I should send a bag of shavings with or just like pack my boxes with shavings. Like like whenever I send out Mecca's marking gauge, it should just be packed with shavings, I guess. Make the border go, what the hell's up with this? <laughs> Trying to fix the edge on this. So there's a chance. I think my last name can be found in English, Scottish, and Welsh backgrounds. 
Um, the last name itself is Welsh. Um, so take that with a grain of salt. Cleaning my way downtown, making rabbits. <laughs> Didn't think these lyrics through before I started. Do 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 do. Rabbit! Rabbits for sale. And then after this, we start using hollows and rounds again. Okay, I gotta read that one. Half of it was concealed by me shaving stuff with wood. Do 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 do. <laughs> wow. Might make it interesting if you were a kid and they made you do a, a report on William Wallace and you're like, why do I need to talk about my grandfather? Stroke to make it. Okay, there. Deep enough. Trying to tell I was one of those kids in school. Because <laughs> I definitely, maybe, said, why do I need to read this book again? I've already read it. Straight to an English teacher. And they're like, well, if you've done it, then write a book report. And I came in the next class with a book report for her. And she just like looked at me and was like, okay. <laughs> Just like threw her off that, yeah, I had read it. <laughs> like most of the stuff they had us read in, in high school, I had already read because I was a very prolific reader as a kid. I think I've done this entire one with a maladjusted plane. But I think it's been just eating its way into the molding. Oops. Doesn't really matter.
Yeah, I ate half the bead off of this side. Woo! I'm doing good. This is what happens when you get cocky. Well, the bead's going to be smaller. It's not my fault. Actually, my mom warned <laughs> teachers about me because it's like, He's going to get bored and he's going to start reading. He's going to ask why he has to do it again, because he's already done it. Definitely a giant screw up on my part, but hey, whatever. Can't really say it's a screw up until it's unusable. So we're going to keep doing this because I don't need the full length honestly, so might as well see what it turns into. Before I condemn this to failuredom. Because it may still be perfectly serviceable. Like this part right here probably just needs to be cut off, but whatever. I don't need the entire breadth of it. Yeah, this part's just gonna get cut off. The rest of it looks okay. But uh, you don't you, you don't use that one here. This one. Just got a few minor screw ups, big deal. I mean, I put ASMR in the tags unless it took it off. Did it take ASMR off? How dare you, Twitch? How dare you? I usually put in auditory ASMR because, I mean, 98% of it is planing. How dare you? And now we're using a round to make this little hollow cove. And if you notice, there are two shavings coming out of it because I'm writing these two little points here.
and slowly you're going to see the curve start to emerge out of it. As I just take these little guys down. Jack, how you doing? Okay. Doing pretty good. Um, we kind of screwed up this stick, but not in a way that I can call it a failure. Probably just going to use this for one of the shorter sides so I can cut off the failure point. It's called strategic woodworking. Oh, he comes in here from time to time. He likes to harass everyone. See what Jack just said here. That is very true, Jack. Um, mastery is just knowing how to adapt to mistakes. Like, I'm sitting here going, well, I, I, I don't need the full 36 inches. I don't even need 36 inches for any of the sides. So having a screw up of, of, you know, like two or three inches down at the bottom, we'll see where we go from there. Okay. See, the cove is starting to show up. Plus, this is my first molding to be turned into picture frame, so if it looks ganky, it's called a learning project. For a reason. It is a learning project. Five hours. Okay, the party starts at five, dear. But, you know, we don't have to be there right at the start, so that's not that big of a deal. Yeah, and the other thing is, is we don't know if some of this is a mistake. Maybe I make the same mistake consistently, and it's no longer a mistake. It's a feature at that point. This, on the other hand, this part is a mistake. It's getting cut off. 
Hey, Tinkerer, how you doing? Okay, now let's get this, this part done. Okay, get this little high point. Last cut. All right. As is tradition, when you make sticking, stick molding, burnish with the shavings. They didn't have sandpaper back then. Sandpaper is actually a very recent invention. <laughs> nice and shiny. We will put that over here. All right. All right, what time is it? Because tired is... Tired. Ah. Hello. I really need to do something about the top-down resolution, don't I? Hello, Violet EPK. How are you doing? Next form, please. Wreath, glass paper, fish scales. Oh. Football clash set. Is it true that would use shark skin? I have no clue about sharps, shark skin, but plain shavings are definitely true. Um, or to set a tall tail. I mean, that would, that would require a lot of sharks being sharked. Let's see, do we want to just move on to a new one? We might want to just move to a new, uh, new stick for a little bit here. Let's make it easy here. What are you? Okay, you're the four. You're the eights. You're the fours. Oh, it's doing pretty good. Um, I mean, there still are a lot of sharks. I just, well, then again, people were really good at whaling, so. It may be part of the whaling industry kind of thing where maybe they just got what, got sharks a lot too. But I, I never really saw a lot of instances where people were catching shark. Um, intentionally catching shark, like whales and stuff like that. Stick. Stick, 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 sticky, sticky, stick, stick. All right. I really do need to build like one dedicated sticking board for this, but I screwed up when I made it and forgot to make the top tier. Or not forgot, just didn't have enough wood to make a top tier. Okay, dogfish. I didn't think about that. Dogfish would definitely be easy to catch. Sticky, sticky, stick, stick. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Uh, you're the bottom then. Pattern piece. Quite possible.
All right, pattern traced. And like I said, this time we're keeping the pattern with the planes so I can just keep going. We might not get to the second stick actually. We're probably just gonna be marking it out and get it ready for tomorrow, Wednesday. Someday, but I mean, we might as well mark it out because that'll take some time off. Also, for, for those who are here and don't know it, I'm realizing I hadn't said anything until just yet. Um, we are having a giveaway, uh, exclamation point giveaway gives you the details, but it is for a Lee Valley glue pot. Not this one, one just like it, just, you know, one that hasn't been used. Um, it'll come with a warming plate and a bag of glue. Uh, it is currently a redeem. Uh, you can put as many uh, redeems as you want in there. It's a thousand points per redeem, uh, per, uh, redeem. And you will be entered. <laughs> yes, I, I'm in love with the glue pot. I know. I know. But uh, sometime near uh, November... What was it? November 15th. We will be doing a drawing for it because it'll be my stream anniversary at that point. Inexperienced glue pot. What? Oh, I don't have an exclamation point. It's just your, uh, just your uh, points on uh, Twitch itself. It's a, it's a Twitch redeem. It, it's, it's just a. a I can't think of the word for it. Sorry. Um, What are they actually called? It, it, it's because um, I don't use uh, stream elements or stream. There we go. It, and it's exclamation point giveaway Mecca. Yeah, there we go. Stream points, not stream elements, not stream labs, uh, stream lab points, uh, just regular old Twitch stream points is what we got here. I make it simple. <laughs> if you come and watch me, you got points. <laughs> We're not going to have two different pools of points here. But we figured out a way to stream and not have to worry about the uh, 
some pump having to be unplugged anymore because we don't have the extra outlet in the garage anymore. So we are we're doing good at this point. Basically what I'm doing is just taking the uh, marking gauge and marking each uh, inflection point on the molding that I need to see on the outside to be able to run my dados so that I can then make my coves. And I had a, an idea, guys, because I'm probably going to end up buying more planes um, because I have a problem. Uh, I'm thinking about building the school box from the cabinet maker and the, jo the joiner and the cabinet maker. Uh, I'm thinking about building that school box and making that my uh, molding plane box. Because God knows I don't have enough room in my Dutch tool chest anymore. And I still like the idea of taking my molding planes out of here whenever I'm not here so that I don't have to worry about specialty left-hand planes um, going into non-existence if there's a flood. Okay, so I don't need to make that line. I do need to make a couple more lines here. <laughs> I, I tell you, Freefall, you're probably going to win this thing because you're just like buying all, all the giveaway points. I think you're like 80% of the entries. So like they gave me knowledge of how to do this later on. So I may have to restrict it to one per user. I mean, they're pretty useful. Like ever, ever since I started using glue pots, I'm not going to lie. They're pretty nice. Like I, I like how hot hide glue works. Bisect it, and we should be good. Yeah, that looked good. That looked good right there. Getting hungry because it's. Well, I mean, there's Mecca and a couple others who have entered. go that's fully marked up ah. Ah. Mm. tasty 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 Are we talking about this guy right here? Jack? Yeah, I love it. Um, the only bad thing about it is, you know, like, you have to inset it into a block of wood. Um, 
I, but I love the dang thing. Um, it was made by Black Bear Forge, I think. Yeah. Um, and the and uh, if you, I I actually had to try it twice before I got it to work to inset. Um, I think uh, there are a couple people doing cast ones, but that one I. I the, the kind of stress I put on, you know, my hold fast and my and my plane stop, I would rather they be forged, not extruded, not cast. I I would rather they be forged. Black Bear does great he does, he does. You just gotta catch them when they're in stock. I've got my four hold fasts and my one plane stop and I think I'm good, unless one of them breaks on me. Yep, going against the grain here, boss. I always try and get it to where I'm doing the back rabbit against the grain. Um, because if it's messy looking, nobody cares. It's the back rabbit. It's the thing that holds the piece of plywood in for the picture frame. <laughs> Nobody's going to be looking at the back rabbit. So I always try to get it to where it runs against the grain because if it tears out, it's fine. And you can tell it's against the grain. <laughs> it's just like, Mer, I don't want to play Ness. But it'll start here in a second. All right, one second here. Do 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 do. Yes, this seems against logic, but it makes it where I don't have to hit the the body of the plane. So I don't risk injuring the plane. Okay. Yep. Bounce that back up a little. Ah, <laughs> come on. Okay. Yeah, no, 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 not set.
There we go. Now it's set correctly, guys. All right, I think we're going to try and get the back rabbit done, and then we're going to call it quits for today. I, I don't know if you guys are catching it, but when I'm holding it, these two fingers are always re trying to register against something. They are my fence. So that I always stay a consistent distance with the rabbit playing from the edge. Oh. Okay, good. <laughs> This side versus this. Okay. Yep, that's what I thought. Okay, we're pretty consistent. And don't worry about where it's not registering against that uh, pencil line because the pencil line is not true. The pencil line is a tracing, it's not the actual mark. getting wispies. Well, we know what that means. Oh.
sure we don't have the same hang up problem as we did last time. Because I forgot to do on that first stick what I did first time, which is okay, cool. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Make sure you fit the back rabbit support. Before you undo. a couple more strokes and then we will do that part again. Okay, there. Back rabbit support is good on that one. Good on this one. Okay, good. So, what we're gonna do, because I am starving, guys, and you have been fairly quiet, we're gonna end up calling it quits for today, because I'm getting starving. But we're gonna have this set up for the next step, I might come down and do a couple more sticks off camera just to speed us along because it looks like it takes me right around an hour a stick. All right, because um, I mean, how, how much can you guys, oh, geez, ah, ah, I forgot this is on. How much can you guys really keep watching me do the same exact sticking mold over and over and over again? I actually found a bunch of metric SHCS mixed into this free batch. Oh, nice. There we go. Okay. Um, we're at Albatross. We're actually about to raid out here. Yet. Um, just 
Letting you know. Oh. Um, don't worry about it. Um, do, 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 do. I like how there's a little frame around my saws. Oh, that that's all right. I I'm glad you could you, you you could join us in too. All right, so let's see what I can find. Let's see. We got Pixie. He's doing taxidermy. Oh. Wow. Nobody's nobody's streaming today. All right, let's see what I can find, guys. There's a lot of pumpkin carvings. And as usual, Legos and building keyboards. Up, 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 what is this? Maybe. If you guys got a suggestion who to raid out to, feel free to yell it out at me. Like right right now I'm just looking for someone interesting. Um How do I not have these metrics groups have created havoc? All right. How about biking Viking? He sounds like a fun one to go to. Oh, it looks like he's just So there's biking Viking. Anything else? Oh, we got someone making uh, wands on a lathe. Good choice. All right, we'll do biking, biking. Let me get back to this uh, where he was at. All right, we're going to raid out to Biking Viking today. Uh, guys, thanks for uh, stopping by. Like I said, I may do some more work on this off stream just so that we can get going a little bit further, a little bit faster, and move on to the next project faster. But until then, see you guys uh, Wednesday, hopefully, and have a good day.